Tonight, some families may be struggling to figure out how their children will be taken care of. Many lost everything in the freezer and refrigerator when they lost power. All of that food can be difficult to replace. Devon Roming has been talking to parents and groups working to help. Hey, Devon. Well, parents tell us it's been a tough few days trying to keep food on the table, but community groups are working to change that. From homes and schools to churches. We were not able to have church. Many remain powerless, but the service must go on for those in need. Especially right now with, with foods flying off the shelf in the grocery store, with power still being out, people's food inside the refrigerators are going out. Pastor Brandon Barber is the missions pastor at Hope City Church near Spring Branch, one of the hardest hit areas during the deadly storm. Whatever the city needs and our community needs, we're trying to be here to help. Partnering with several organizations like Convoy of Hope and Mercy Chefs, an organization that served more than 26 million meals worldwide since 2007. Since we hit the ground uh, yesterday running, we have probably done uh, over 5,000 meals already. Providing everything from cleaning supplies and non-perishable foods to hot meals. Meals which Barber says families with kids are depending on as Spring Branch ISD schools remain closed until further notice. If they're not meeting in school, then they can't get those meals. Whether they come here to get food and supplies or we take it to them, we want to make sure that our teachers, our schools, and our community make sure they're not missing out on anything. Offering a little hope in a city that remains strong through it all. Right now we're scheduled Monday through Wednesday and we have two shifts, 11 a.m. and 5 p.m. But if we need to go beyond that this, this week, we're going to continue to be a help to our city. Now, leaders with HISD schools say they plan to open more than 200 schools tomorrow. They will also have meals available for pickup at schools which remain closed. In Houston, Devon Roming, KHOU 11 News.